today. Four minutes to go. It is something really special for Exeter to really get back into this time. Go. They finally sealed the victory they deserved. Matt Oakley playing in Ollie Watkins and the substitute, who'd only been on the field for four minutes, beat Alec to book Exeter's first round three appearance in a decade. Ball into the channel. It's very well played by Ollie Watkins. He's done really well. Watkins, what a goal! Superb strike from Ollie Watkins. Oh. Now Watkins deflected and in. Exeter finally take the lead. Back in the game, but it's 4 1 now. Ollie Watkins. Taylor, Taylor squeezes the cross in and Watkins nods it home and Exeter open up a two goal lead. Crawley this time, straight to Harley. And here is Watkins with the shot and it's into the net. Well, how did McCormick let that one slip by him? Watkins trying to challenge for the ball, it breaks for Noble. Here is Watkins again, it's a nice bit of skill. It's away from two Plymouth Argyle defenders. And now pulls the trigger. Oh, what a goal. In the Devon derby, Ollie Watkins goes into Exeter Folklore. It's a 92nd minute screamer. And the player. Exeter now can finally get towards the final third. Holmes. Watkins sits up. And a beautiful strike from 18 yards out. And Exeter take the lead in the return ball. Of space and he's done really well there Watkins still on the charge might go alone a fine individual goal from Ollie Watkins halves the deficit so now Jake Taylor spreads the play the ball is eventually snaked into the far corner of the goal Ollie Watkins now it's X is coming forward again oh lovely piece of play on that far side well open up for the visitors once more, Watkins! Wow, would you believe it? Two goals in two minutes for Exeter City. These two sides losing there, in this group. It's the opportunity for Exeter City. Inside the Chelsea penalty area, it was prohibitive. It's at the back post and it's a fine header for 1-0. By Ruben Reid, looking for his 100th goal of his career this evening. Made it 99 with the strike that he had on the weekend. As it's into Watkins! Exeter have the lead. And then... Good work. Now, crossing opportunity for Holmes, maybe. Does get in the cross and driven into the back of the net. Ollie Watkins on. Too long to go now. Fallen over there. Referee saw nothing wrong and neither did I. And it could be a chance here. Watkins. Score the only goal so far, and he's going to squeeze it into the far post to seal it for Exeter City. Half the length of the field, and the 20-year-old. Yes. The way here, as far as Watkins, all over the top of Mate's head. Michael Linden, the curling cross, and the header into the net for Watkins. City coming forward and looking dangerous. Michael Linden gets past Mate. McElinden, it's into the net, it's 2-0. Ollie Watkins again. He cleared away. Newport could be in trouble now. We're into the 95th minute and the break is very much on here for Exeter City. And chasing the ball is the man on his hat-trick. It's Watkins! He's done it! Hat-trick sealed. The perfect end of 2016 for Ollie Watkins and Exeter City. Perfect counter attack, the goal keeper. Forward by Watkins, who has it back in. Still Watkins, lovely change of direction. 3 0 to Exeter. And that makes sure of the points. A wonderful goal from Ollie Watkins. Just have to get the ball forward. Oh, but they've given it away. It's a chance for Ollie Watkins, who goes around the goalkeeper and provides a wonderful finish at the end of it. City. 
inside the box they go. Across the face of goal, all the way to the back post. And Tolly Watkins. Ball up. And away, and as far as Watkins. It's control. The three Crawley players deflected and into the back of the net. And it's Ollie Watkins, the 21 year old star. Ollie Watkins. Watkins is twisting and turning. Watkins skips away from his man. It's still Ollie Watkins. And in superb fashion, Ollie Watkins gives Exeter City the lead. The goals. They found the back of the net. Poor defending from Carlisle United. Holly Watkins with the open two. Either way. Goal for Exeter. Just seen it though. Holly Watkins turns onto his left foot and picks out the top corner. Will that be enough to see Exeter City at Wembley in the League Two playoff final? These managers certainly not getting carried away. Ollie Watkins celebrating with the fans. He took that so well for his second of the game. Just 11 minutes to go. It should be enough to see Exeter City 